What's up, everybody, and welcome back to Tam's Table. Today, I am having Big Pie in the Sky Pizza. That's right, Big Pie in the Sky Pizza. It was featured on the Travel Channel on the show Man vs. Food. You know, the guy that travels the world trying to see if he can eat certain things and win certain challenges. And there are only two locations, one in Marietta, Georgia, and the other one is in Roswell, Georgia. So I went and got some pizza because one of my subscribers and somebody that I follow here on YouTube, and I'll mention him later, just was eating some pizza in a video and was tearing it up. So I just had to have some pizza. So I am hungry. I'm going to bless my food and I'm going to get to grubbing. Gracious God, I want to thank you for this food that I'm about to receive. Lord, I ask that you will bless it and sanctify it for the nourishment of my body. Lord, those that do not have anything to eat and don't know where their next meal is coming from, Lord, please provide for them as you are Jehovah Jireh. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for pulling up a chair. Tam's table. I'm not going to be rude, but I'm about to eat. Oh, and this is your, if this is your first time pulling up a chair... Please subscribe. When you subscribe, you get oh Lord. When you when you subscribe, you get preferred seating. Thank you, Jesus. I just got pepperoni in. Mmm. Extra cheese. Mmm. <sighs> oh my god. Mmm. I'm so sorry for smacking. Napkin. I'm sorry. I don't want to have a greasy mouth. Mm. Woo. Mm, 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 mm. I haven't had pizza in a while. And when I eat pizza, I want it to be good. Where's the best pizza? Is it Chicago? Mmm. Mmm. Mmm! Or New York? Let me know in the comments. Where's the best pizza? Sometimes I like deep dish Chicago. Sometimes I like that thin crust. Cause I ain't trying to mess around. I'm trying to get right on to it. Mm -hmm. I got some shout outs. Uh huh. While I'm pulling up my shout outs, what is everybody eating today? Are you having pizza like me? Probably not on a Sunday. You never know. Hmm. Shout out to Big Pie in the Sky. This pizza is good. I called ahead. Because I know they're really busy on Sundays. They have everybody going in to do the carnivore challenge, which is what Man vs. Food was doing. And you have to eat the whole big pie of carnivore, which is meat lovers. Their carnivore pizza in under, I think, 60 minutes. And you get to have somebody help you. That's how big this pie is. No thanks. No thanks. I just have a slice. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Now they finally got quiet outside. I was hoping they would because I'm like, don't school start. Come on. Earlier, it sounded like they was having a parade or a block party or something. While I was doing my makeup, I said, Lord, when I do my makeup, I don't, I don't record any sound. Well, I mute it out. 
I be praying the whole time, please. By the time I record my food video, my mukbang, please let them hush. Please. And my mom said, you really can't hear the background noise. And I had another friend say, it's real faint. So, in other words, I be overreacting. So, I'm sorry. Not to them, to y'all. I ain't sorry to them. <laughs> I'm a mess. All right, so y'all know I have a challenge out right now. It's called the Sauce on Everything Challenge. So far, I've had Sister Ro completed. I already told y'all what she ate. Go check her channel out. And next, I had Dining with Gina Diva. Dining with Gina Diva. She did rotisserie chicken and salad, and she put ranch all over the rotisserie chicken and the salad, so... She was successful. The next person who did it is responsible for me eating pizza tonight. Wayne Boogie Eats. Mr. Wayne Boogie Eats. I really like his channel. Cool dude. He did Pizza Hut. Buffalo wings. And um, a, a large pizza. And he drizzled sauce on the buffalo wings. And the pizza. Successful. So I, I got a bunch of other people that say they're going to complete the challenge. So please, if you have any questions, just ask me. Shoot me a DM. Leave it in the comments. What are the rules for the sauce and everything challenge? I'll leave the link to that video at the bottom of this one. I got some other shout outs too that I'm going to give all through the video. But this piece is talking to me. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. This pizza is like three slices. Somebody at Tam's table who came to enjoy me tonight. Help me eat this pizza. Here. Here. Take a bite. Open your mouth. They ah. Ah. <laughs> I'm just sharing. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm. Excuse me for being rude. What am I drinking tonight? Nope. Water. <laughs> I'm drinking ice water tonight, y'all. Ice whole ice water. I didn't get a chance to go to the store. Because I can't go to the store hungry or I will buy the whole store. Like, the whole store will be in my shopping cart. I'll have everything in there from bags of candy, chips, stuff I don't even eat. Ooh, I need some of these crackers. Ooh, I need some of these noodles. Got tons of noodles over there. I need some skins. <laughs> Y'all eat pork rinds? Have all that stuff, all them snacks in my pantry and on top of my refrigerator for what? Mm -mm. All right. Let me shout out some of my new subscribers. Y'all, I got some. I had to subscribe to these people. These are people that have subscribed to me. And people that I had to subscribe back to. And when I tell you, I absolutely love their channels. And I'm going to tell you why. Fat Boy Show. F-A-T-B-O-I-S-H-O-W. I'm going to put his official link below. He is hilarious. Young college student. Work at Cracker Barrel. And I can tell you this because he puts it on his page. And he, he's just so genuine and so funny. Like he will have you dying laughing. Fat boy show. Hilarious. Chewy boy. C-H-E-W-Y-B-O-I. Chewy boy. I like him. I like his personality. 
I'm gonna put this link in the description box below too. Mmm, cooking with Tracy. New Orleans in the house. New Orleans, Louisiana. Baby, if you like the Nola culture, New Orleans, Louisiana, them accents. My mama this. And oh, 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 no, oh, no. We going to make groceries. We want to make groceries. I was a fail. <laughs> but, baby, I got a friend. Hey, Ivory. Her whole family live here. And they from New Orleans, Louisiana. I love hanging out with them. The whole culture. Who that? <laughs> Shout out to Cookie and Tracy. Um, peace and eats. Hey girl. These delicious bites. Ew. Corey Ball. Congratulations on just reaching 200 subscribers. I think I'm close. I don't know. We'll have to see. I'm at a hundred or something. Chi Chi eats. The Ochoa family. Y'all, these people just try to eat a hundred nuggets. A hundred chicken McNuggets. <laughs> With the kids. They put a little dent in them, but. Uh -uh. They, they, uh -uh. I don't, they didn't win. They didn't win that challenge. <laughs> Shout out to y'all. Life with Mommy Anna Ashleyana. Hey, it's Life with Mommy Anna Ashleyana. And last but not least, Teak ASMR. She does ASMR. That's it. I haven't seen her do a lot of communicating and talking, and but she just does ASMR. So if that is your thing, follow her. Me. I only do ASMR from time to time, but for the most part, I'm doing a conversation style video. Some people like it, some people hate it. They be in the comments like, too much talking. I be like, thanks for watching. They be like, no problem. Peace. <laughs> yeah. It's the plastic straw, y'all. Listen, the straw gangs out there, please don't come and beat me up. I know it's a bunch of environmentalists. I got a cousin that's an environmentalist. And she be like, no, no plastic straws. Listen, if y'all would love to sew into Tam's table, I will leave my cash app below. And I will purchase some metal straws. From Amazon. There you go. But until then. Ah, ice cold. Let me get back into this little pizza. Mm. Speaking of pizza. Did y'all hear about the man. In Arizona. That choked his daughter. About the last slice of pizza. Check this out. Arizona man reportedly chokes daughter over argument about the last slice of pizza. 41-year-old is currently facing nine counts of child abuse. So she was a minor. And four counts of aggravated assault after he allegedly choked out his 16-year-old yep, daughter following an argument about the final slice of pizza. Her face, wait, whoa, when the police arrived at the home, the teenage victim had a swollen, bruised face, bruises on her abdomen, and scratch marks along her neck. And when they questioned him, he admitted that he became upset and choked her, admitted choking her. Now listen, I know pizza is, is, is good, but it ain't that good that you got to choke somebody. Your own kid? child abuse over a slice of pizza. Just order another one, sir. Hmm. 
laughing. Who wanna go grocery shopping with me? I'm going grocery shopping after this. Anybody at the table? Is there one? Come. I started doing church. Is there one? Is there one? Come. Help me to stay disciplined and get only the stuff I need for the week. Mm. Uh-oh. We finally got a piece of the pie. Yeah. The pan has got pizza. Mm. Oh, my God. Have y'all heard about the tarantula migration? If you live in Colorado, specifically the southern part of Colorado, y'all about to have some visitors from, what they say, late August through October. Tarantulas. Molly, you in danger, girl. <laughs> It's saying, if you suffer from arachnophobia, you might want to consider staying up north in Colorado. The Gazette reported Wednesday that the migration is expected to begin this month through early October. With tarantulas. Scientists say the majority of the spiders are 10-year-old males looking to mate with Females hidden in Colorado's grasslands. Listen, I don't care what they're looking for. Don't listen. If I'm leaving for work that morning and it's a tarantula at my doorstep, hey, good morning. How are you? Yeah, I won't be able to make it to work today. Yeah, there's a, a tarantula at my doorstep. Yeah, and he, yeah, he, um, he has pretty much decided that I'm, I'm going to be using some, um, paid time off. All right, so I will see you all, uh, tomorrow, Lord willing. Okay, all right, bye. I am not. I'm with no tarantulas. Y'all know what I mean. I ain't no tarantulas. Okay. These things migrate, migrate like that every year. Listen, if that happened in Atlanta, I would move back to Cleveland. I don't know about that. But I would move. I would certainly move. Mm. There you have it. All right, y'all, the time is now 7.57 East Coast time here in Atlanta, Georgia, and it is Sunday, so y'all know what that means. Sunday Best is getting ready to come on. Sunday Best. Do -do 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 -do. Sunday Best. Oh, have it go. Shout out to Rachel James. She arranged <laughs> She arranged that, and um, yeah, I like it. Shout out to Adam and the band. They've been killing this season, so I am going to sign out so that I can watch my show. It is the only show left that i watch on tv the only one everything else is youtube so y'all know how that go so if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you have not subscribed yet please subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified when i post new content and don't forget to share 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 this video with everyone facebook instagram twitter do people still use twitter i don't know but my name is Tamara Faye, and this has been Tam's Table. Thank you so much for tuning in, and bye.